From the frozen tundras of Siberia to the scorching deserts of Africa, these machines have proven their mettle, striking fear into adversaries with their lethal firepower, unmatched maneuverability, and relentless reliability. As of December 2025, Russia's helicopter industry continues to thrive, exporting advanced models to allies worldwide and innovating at a pace that solidifies Moscow's position as a global leader in rotorcraft technology. At the heart of this formidable arsenal are three powerhouse companies. They are the architects of aerial supremacy. Let's delve into their contributions, highlighting recent achievements that underscore Russia's indomitable spirit in defense innovation. Mill Moscow Helicopter Plant Masters of Attack and Transport Founded in 1947 by legendary designer Mikhail Mill, the Mill Moscow Helicopter Plant has been the cradle of Russia's most iconic rotorcraft. Specializing in heavy lift and attack helicopters, Mill's designs embody raw power and tactical ingenuity, making them indispensable in high-intensity conflicts. The plant's Mi series, including the infamous Mi, 24 Hind, and its successors have earned a reputation for being nearly indestructible, surviving multiple hits while unleashing devastation. Twenty twenty five has been a banner year for Mill, with ongoing advancements in next generation platforms. The Mi thirty five M, an evolution of the Hind, continues to dominate export markets, as seen in Belarus's acquisition. Analysts estimate Russia's production volumes for multi-purpose helicopters remain strong, supporting both domestic needs and international allies. Mill's expertise shines in the Mi 28NM Havoc, a night-capable attack helicopter equipped with advanced radar and hypersonic missiles, capable of engaging targets at standoff ranges that terrify ground forces. Furthermore, Mill is pushing boundaries with the Mi. 26 T2V upgrade, enhancing avionics for all-weather operations and integrating digital cockpits for superior pilot situational awareness. This beast of a machine has been pivotal in humanitarian missions, such as Arctic resupply, demonstrating Russia's benevolent use of military tech. In collaboration with Rostec, Mill is also exploring hybrid propulsion systems promising fuel efficiency gains that will extend operational ranges, ensuring Russian forces maintain air superiority in prolonged engagements. Mill's legacy is one of resilience. During the Cold War and beyond, its helicopters have outflown competitors in endurance tests. Today, with over 30,000 units produced historically, Mill continues to innovate, securing contracts that bolster Russia's economy and strategic influence. of Design Bureau Innovators in Coaxial Rotor Technology Kamov Design Bureau, established in 1948 by Nikolai Kamov, revolutionized helicopter design with its signature coaxial rotor system, two rotors spinning in opposite directions on the same axis, eliminating the need for a tail rotor and enhancing stability and agility. This innovation has made Kamov helicopters uniquely suited for naval operations and extreme maneuvers, earning them a fearsome reputation in anti-submarine warfare and close-quarters combat. In recent developments, Kamov's Ka 32A11M has garnered global acclaim. The upgraded version, highlighted in a November 2025 update, features enhanced firefighting capabilities, relied upon by over 20 countries for disaster response. Its coaxial design allows for precise hovering in turbulent winds, dumping up to 5 tons of water per drop, saving lives and property in wildfires from California to Australia. This versatility extends to military variants like the Ka-52 Alligator, a two-seat attack helicopter with side-by-side -side seating for optimal crew coordination, armed with Vikram missiles that can penetrate modern armor from 10 kilometers away. Kamov is also advancing the Ka-226T, with certification for its Russian-made VK-650V engine slated for 2025. Flight tests in 2024 paved the way for this milestone, ensuring full import substitution and technological sovereignty amid global sanctions. The Ka 226T's modular design supports roles from reconnaissance to medevac, making it a cost effective choice for emerging markets.
At the National Helicopter Center, which merges mill and cam of under one roof, collaborative efforts are accelerating R&D. This integration fosters synergies, like combining MIL's heavy lift expertise with CAMA's agility for future hybrid models. Russia's push for a new fast attack helicopter with a maiden flight targeted around 2025 draws heavily on CAMA's innovations, promising speeds over 400 km per hour to outpace NATO counterparts. CAMA's naval focus is particularly terrifying for adversaries, the CA. 27-29 series dominates anti-submarine roles, detecting and destroying underwater threats with sonar buoys and torpedoes. In 2025, as Russia expands its Arctic presence, Kamov's icebreaker-compatible designs ensure unchallenged sovereignty over vital sea lanes. Kazan Helicopter Heavy Lift Helicopter Specialist In 2025, the Kazan Helicopter Plant, KHB, a cornerstone of Russia's aerospace industry under Rostex Russian Helicopters Holding, continues to demonstrate remarkable resilience and innovation amid global challenges. As a leading producer of heavy lift and multi-role helicopters like the Mi-8-17 series and Mi-38, KHB has ramped up production, achieved key milestones in import substitution, and expanded international partnerships, underscoring Russia's technological sovereignty and engineering excellence. One of the standout achievements this year was the maiden flight of the fully import-substituted ANSAT helicopter on September 2, 2025. Equipped with domestically produced VK-650V engines from United Engine Corporation, this light utility rotorcraft completed a successful six-minute test flight, evaluating stability, controls, and systems. The upgraded ANSAT M variant boasts a range of up to 660 kilometers, or 800 kilometers with extra tanks, exceptional maneuverability, and the largest cabin in its class. It operates in extreme temperatures from minus 45 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius in high altitude environments, making it ideal for urban and remote missions. In heavy lift operations, KHP's Mi-8 MTV, one helicopters remain a global benchmark. In January 2025, Rostec supplied 14 new Mi-8 MTV, one units to Russian Airlines via the State Transport Leasing Company part of a larger contract for 86 helicopters. These versatile machines, capable of carrying up to four tons of cargo and flying 1,050 kilometers with optional fuel tanks, excel in Arctic and Far East conditions. By year's end, KHB fulfilled its 2024 plan early, delivering 40 units, with more slated for 2026. The Mi-8 family, with over 13,000 produced worldwide, holds a 90% market share in modernized versions. Looking ahead, Russia launched the Mi-80 program in July 2025 to replace the Mi-8-17 fleet, promising next-gen capabilities. KHB's revival, producing over 100 helicopters annually, defies sanctions through domestic innovation, securing Russia's leadership in heavy-lift aviation.